Miss Gladys. Wait, the cameras are in the way. I can't even. Hi. <laughs> Miss Gladys, you're an inspiration to me and to so many as a woman and as an artist. And we see, we love you. We love you. <laughs> From the bottom of my heart, I love you. And I can't wait for the day we get to work together. <laughs> I hope that day comes very soon. But it is truly a pleasure and honor. It is, it is my joy to present you with the 2005 BET Lifetime Achievement Award. Give it up for Miss Gladys Knight. Yeah. This is so humbling. It really, really is. And this is real, too, because it's heavy. <laughs> it, it really is. You know, when I, when I watch TV and I, I see award shows like this, I don't know why, but my mind goes to, I wonder what their journey was like, how they got to where they were, never thinking that I had a journey of my own, OK? And then they would come to the podium, and they would think all these people that I didn't know you know? And I said, okay, so rather than do that tonight, I, I, I want to say three, na three names that I think all of you will identify with, and if you don't identify with it, I know you've heard of them before. And that is my Heavenly Father God, who made such an awesome plan for my life. My big brother, Jesus Christ, he is our brother because we're all his children. Because he came down here and showed us how it was supposed to be done, so I had a road map. And the Holy Spirit because he's been there to lead and guide and show me the way. Even though I have not always done what my big brother did, and I have not always listened to that still small voice, I thank him for, for putting the family in my life that he has, my mom and dad, all of you. There are numerous people that have come my way that made it possible for me to be standing in this place. I can't name them all. He has given me, I cannot go anywhere because I went on the road with the Pips when I was eight years old believe it or not. And um, Steve gave me a few years on it. Okay, he did. I mean, it's been 57 years, Steve. It has. And that young man that you saw earlier in the video, his name is William. That was not Langston. And I correct that because those are the three guys, Bubba, William, and Edward, who raised me all of those 40-some years that we were on the road together. I am so grateful for every single blessing that I've had. My wonderful, wonderful husband who loves me unconditionally. You can't find them these days. You know? Every record that you bought and every concert ticket that you've paid for has allowed me to be in this spot today, and I am so humble because you helped me to come this far. Thank you so very much. You be good to yourselves and love one another. Good night, everybody.